You want to say good morning? This is my early morning buddy. We've been up for the last two hours. Good morning. Good morning. Everybody else is just now waking up and we've been up forever. Ever and ever and ever. You little turkey. Why do you wake up so early? It's a very serious question. Drakey, why do you wake up so early? Every single day. How come? I don't feel like I've, I've truly even recovered yet from New York as far as tired goes because of this little pipsqueak. Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, drink crazy. Drink crazy! So I'm making breakfast and packing lunch right now. Here is breakfast. If you touch your brother again, you're gonna go to town. Okay. Okay, I just picked up the floor because I'm going to have the Roomba go while we're gone. So the floor's cleaned up. Now i got to go to school. Alright, we just dropped uh, Deacon off at school. And now we're going to go take the puppies for a... <laughs> or stop it. For a run. He's faking. So I'm out running the dogs because they they need it. And I've been doing it for the last 11 years. And I've been doing it in roughly the same places places like this so yesterday we're out here and I didn't have the kids they were both at school and um I sorry about the sound effects Drake says he's scaring off the snakes um so anyways I've been doing this for 11 years now and I know that there's snakes out here I know there's rattlesnakes I know that there's all sorts of critters tarantulas everything I mean we're we're in nature but <laughs> so um I'm not, you know, I'm not naive to that. However, for the first time yesterday, we're out here and I, the dogs are about, I would say about 10 feet ahead of me and they start acting really strange and I start to hear a rattle and I was like, get out of here, You're like get away from it. So, um, I obviously get them off of it right away and I wanted to go over and look at it. <laughs> However, if I went that way, my dogs will follow me. So they go the direction that I go. And if I went over to look at it, they would have gone with me and I didn't want them to go back into the, the rattlesnake's face. So <laughs> we walked back to the car and then I got in my car and I was like, I just want to see it. Like, I want to see exactly what it was. I mean, hearing a rattlesnake's rattle is like undeniable, but, um, you know, I actually wanted to see what it looked like. So. We drove over and it was right off the path and I actually posted a picture and a little video on Instagram of him. Um, he wasn't mad when I saw him and like he was, you know, he wasn't like ag aggressive towards me. But stop recording. Let me show you. Drake, show me. I'm not recording right now. I'm recording you right now. Is that okay? No. No? Do you want me to turn it off? Yeah, turn it off. Okay. So, but I wasn't like, uh, you know you know making him mad or doing anything that would make him mad and I was in the car so he was he was fine so anyways um yeah the snake was over there so we're just being extra cautious like always staying on the paths and just looking out they don't you know obviously freak me out that much my mom's like don't go back out there I'm like mom they're in your backyard <laughs> like <laughs> oh drakey For being 11 year old dogs, they have so much energy. It's crazy. Oh, and then the other thing I was going to say, and the whole point of that story was that it must be like El Nino or something wonky because I don't know how I can go 11 years without seeing any snakes and then two weeks in a row I see them. Like, how crazy is that? What's annoying? My talking? Wow, thank you for that, son. I love you too, buddy. <laughs> What'd you find, buddy? I got, I got two on me. Let me see your ants. Okay, no. They're nice. Is that a nice ant? Yeah. yeah. Hey. Don't fling him. Oh. You didn't sign up to be picked up. I don't want them on me. Well, then don't pick them up if you don't want them on you. Hey, hey, come on. Oh my gosh, how many is on me? You got a whole bunch, don't you? You probably got dirty little fingers. I want. Let me see him. Huh? Ah, they're going everywhere. Yeah, they are. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys exactly where I met my little friend yesterday. So this road goes down. Normally, like, we hike all the back in here. 
Um, today I need to get home and clean my kitchen. But anyways, the snake was right here at that turn. So like right at the top of this little hill, there's, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like sage, 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 and then like a greener bush and he was right there. So that's where I met my little friend yesterday. And they can zoom in. Yep, right there. I can't see the snake. Yep, because he's in the bushes somewhere. Hopefully he got away from the road. Let's go home and do some dishes, okay? Guys, I'm telling you. Well worth the investment. My gosh, I love that thing. So I've got dishes, an incredibly dirty counter. I've got just stuff all over the place. So um, these I need to pack up for baseball snacks. Anyways, I am going to clean the kitchen now. Dishes are done and running. It took me 22 minutes. <sighs> so, much better, huh? Like, much, much, much better. Still, I mean, room for improvement, but much better. Look at my cute little tea area. Oh, I love it. It's got a lot of meaning. Again, Instagram, I posted a picture. So, anyways, now I need to, I need to mop. So, I'm gonna do that. So the boys wanted these for a T-ball snack. So I got these, there's 80, it was like 10 bucks, it's a great deal. So this, I'm gonna do one of the little snack and then maybe like bottles of water. And I think I'm gonna put them in here, but I wanna like bedazzle the bag. What do you guys think? Is there, what, do you, what would you do? I'm just curious. So this is, I'm gonna use these because I'm not using these like I thought I would. I got them at JBF last year and I'm just, I'm not using them up. So I wanna use these. I just don't know. What else, what would you guys put in here? I haven't even shown you guys this one yet. So this right here is just a, a gift of straight up love. Um, it is a, a mopping, it's a mopping robot. Can you tell I've developed a new obsession? So anyways, it's gonna mop and we are actually going to go over, we have a little play date. So um, we're gonna go do that right now for actually for Mother's Day stuff. So I'll show you. This little guy sprays and cleans and I just got the reusable pad for it and <sighs> yep so we'll come back to clean kitchen floor let it go watch it's super cute <laughs> I just realized I should tell you guys what it is it's the Brava it's iRobot's Brava Jet so it's the same makers that I got my vacuum from and it's just the little um the floor one so if it goes back and forth and scrubs everything up. Does a really good job too. Let me see. Sam? Is it an ant? Oh yeah, it is an ant, isn't it? Man, the iPhone can have like insane. <laughs> now it won't refocus. <sighs> Alright, we're gonna go. Gianna, what? Did you want scrunchie? Can you sit right here? Gianna, look out next to you. Yep. Yep, Jordan. I'm next. I'm next to you. What are you making? These are all for the bees. You're making bee potion? Yeah. They're drinking it. And they're going to be dead. Well, that's interesting. Do you want the bees to come to it or go away from it? Come to it. Come to it. That's very nice. You guys are very sweet. We're making these for Oh my. Just picked up the kids from school and then met um, my friends, my friend's niece at the bus stop because she goes to a different school than the other two go to. And uh, yeah, now they're running home. It's adorable. <laughs> Did you hurt your brother? No. Yes! A million kids in here. Ask Annabelle. 
Literally, I saw. Oof. We just got to Deacon's game, and if you ask me, I think it's gonna rain. What do you think? <laughs> Looks like it's coming. I don't know, nothing yet though. There's Drake. Hey, buddy. So something about Drake, he always plays with much older kids. He can like hang with the big guys. It started. Drake just went down the slide. I'm gonna pee my pants. Thankfully, my boyfriend came out, so he uh, too much Drake. And is is riding home with with my boyfriend. So they are they're heading home, and I got Drake. The lighting's really pretty right now. What do you want for dinner? I don't know either. I didn't plan it through. I got caught up helping my friend, and just <sighs> didn't work out very well. Hey. I want something fast, and then we go for a really quick, maybe a little dark too fast. We've been liking walking in the evenings, but it's just too, it's a little too late for somebody who was up so early. No, it's not. No, right now it's nice. I'm going to get dinner going. Deacon's working, going to do his homework. And then, uh, yep. I gotta feed them something. I don't know what. But see, I ate mine all the way. Huh. Daddy, what is it good? Mommy. Is it Drake? I'm gonna try it. I'm trying to grab his water. You might be a little bit hot, so be sure you check them, okay? Is it a good dinner? Gage, you look wiped out, kid. Gage? Mommy? Okay, go ahead and tell me. Um, so I want potty. Okay. And, um, I did. And I did, I brush my teeth. Good job. Then I, I take off my clothes and put my jammies on. Are they all on? Yep. Okay. Then I brush my teeth. <laughs> Why don't you go downstairs and say goodnight? Last time. Well, hit it right on the hand. One more. Oh! Oh! Okay. Yeah! We did it! Did it. Did I'm gonna do it! Your pants are wonky. Oh! Uh. Oh! Ouch! Alright, bedtime. Oh. I just got my boys in bed and woo, are they like beyond tired. It's 8.30. Somehow the night got late fast. I just came into my room <coughs> to change and put on a more comfortable sweatshirt because... The sweatshirt I had on wasn't comfortable enough. Um, I'm such a bum sometimes. They're already calling my name. They need to go to sleep. They're both just beyond tired. And I need to get to work. So I'm going to work a few hours tonight. Hopefully they go to bed right now. I'm changing. They're driving me nuts. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys soon.